Hey everyone, today I want to provide a brief addition to the Alpha Kestrel Guide that I released back in March. This video will go over the skills you will purchase and train to fly the T0 Dark Rocket Kestrel on day one of your Alpha account. As before, this guide assumes you utilize the referral link to get the free 1 million skill points. The setup will use about 600,000 of those provided. You can use my referral link below, but if you have a friend who plays, you can use theirs and share the rewards. They will also likely be able to help cover your initial investment costs. That initial investment will require between 10 to 12 million ISK based on GTA values today. If you are on your own, then you should be able to meet the ISK requirements shortly after you get through the tutorial. Worst case, you can always ask for help in the Abyssal Lurker channels. This initial investment will get you the skills you need in one Arbalest Launcher Kestrel, shown here, as well as ammunition and tranquil dark filaments. Once you create a character, have skill points available, and have the necessary ISK, then go ahead and begin by purchasing and injecting the following skills. Rockets, Shield Operation, Rapid Launch, Warhead Upgrades, Missile Bombardment, Missile Projection, Target Navigation Prediction, Guided Missile Precision, and Acceleration Control. My character is Kaldari. If you go with another race, you will need to pick up at least the Kaldari Frigate Skillbook as well. This is cheap though, on ISK and skill points. You can also go ahead and purchase the fit featured here and in the description below. Next, begin applying your referral skill points. Make sure to match the list on screen now. Feel free to pause if you want to copy it now, but I'm also including a link for this character's profile below in the description. Overall, 373,000 of our referral link skill points will go into the missile skills. Some of these support skills are not required for T0, but will make your life easier and you will want them when you move into more difficult content. After all of this training, my character had about 323,000 of the free SP remaining. With this fit and these skills, we sit at about 97 rocket DPS and 31 EHP per second repair. To finish, I'll show this character dealing with two spawns that give us the 90 DPS requirement. First up, the Devoted Hunter. Same as the original guide, you will swap to Mjolnir rockets and set an orbit to 500 meters and kill the Hunter. Last, the Skybreaker. While he cannot kill us, he actually has a decent damage requirement to break his own tank. Swap to Inferno rockets here, orbit at about a thousand meters, and he will die. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out in game or leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and good luck.